Okay, so here's a very quick primer on debugging JavaScript in Visual Studio Code IDE. First thing I've got is Live Server Extension, which is a free extension. So if you haven't got that, get Live Server, and then you can just run your project or app in the browser. And I've just done that, came up in my other screen. Just got a quick little quiz app, again, from that channel, just followed them. Nothing will happen unless you put breakpoints. Okay, so if I come over to the run and debug, then you'll see in here, this may not be set the first time, but you can choose your type of debugger. Now, I'm just going to launch Chrome against localhost. Okay, that's just a simple one. Do it in the web browser and I'm going to start debugging by pressing the green icon. Very similar to Visual Studio 2022, etc. if you use them. You can see this has popped up here. Now let's just test something. Okay, so if I'm going to test the click, let's just put a breakpoint on there. And you'll see these subtle controls pop up here as well, right? So pause, step over, step into. So over is to go to the next if you hit a breakpoint. Into is to go into if there's any sub methods called. Step out is if you want to jump out of a function you're in. Restart and stop. So let me set a breakpoint in the select answer function. Press next. And that's breaking but it has hit so i've hit my advent add event listener click and show question is calling it there so if i press step into then you can see what's happening here step over and remember you can see all the values going on here so my answer dot text obviously i can see that on hover but i can also see it here and you can just expand and you know exactly what's happening at any one time. If you want to add a watch, you just click on it in here and add to watch. And then that just stays permanently in there, okay? And again, expand if you want to see the values or anything that is held within it. You can go down as many levels as there are. And continue, step over, let's just step over. And you get to see, this is where we're executing. You can just keep stepping over. You'll see if you hit the true on here obviously that jumped out so it didn't hit true and so on if you found it useful check out my video here and i'll see you over there thanks